A simple online search will show you just how diverse our planet is. Yet, it isn't until you see these surreal destinations with your own eyes that you can both appreciate their beauty and untamed power. Travel is one of life's great pleasures, and there are many different ways to fill up your passport. Yet, venturing to some of the most unique sites will do more than just fill your camera with Insta-worthy pictures. From inhospitable deserts to magical caves and everything in between, this video will show you why you should never stop exploring. Number 25. White Desert. Egypt's White Desert is an alien landscape that belongs on everyone's list. Forget the popular pyramids, the White Desert is a treasure chest of natural wonders, highlighted by the utterly confounding rock formations found within the national park. The journey begins by venturing into the Black Desert, complete with ancient lava stones. After some dune bashing, you'll find yourself within a desert coated white by calcified limestone and sculpted by the fine and dainty hand of Mother Nature. The snow-white landscape also offers sandboarding, mountain biking, and utterly gorgeous stargazing. Number 24. Lake Natron. An alkaline lake in Tanzania's Arusha region, Lake Natron is known as the deadliest lake on Earth. No, Lake Natron is not your typical lakeside getaway. Here, you'll trade swimming for admiring one of the world's most inhospitable landscapes. Images of animals that have been turned to stone have placed this destination on the map. Because of its high pH levels, chemical makeup, and heavy evaporation, the waters of Lake Natron look dark red in color, an ominous sign. Yet it doesn't scare the lesser flamingos, which are famous for flocking to Lake Natron once every three to four years when conditions are right. Number 28. Bryce Canyon. Bryce Canyon National Park is famous for its rock formations. Known as hoodoos, these spire-like sandstone rocks jut into the sky for a supremely interesting landscape. It's been sculpted over time by freeze-thaw erosion and has morphed the soft sandstone into the marvelous landscape it is today. There are various trails, such as the Rim Trail, weaving through the rocks. Bryce Point is the perfect spot for views out over the so-called Silent City, with the vista below made up of walls of rock and hoodoos looking like somewhere from another time and place. Number 22. Pangna Bay. Surrounded by rugged cliffs and intriguing caves, Pangna Bay features some of the best paddling on Earth. This surreal destination hit the mainstream with a helping hand from Hollywood, featuring in James Bond and Star Wars. But on arrival, you'll quickly realize the bay was always destined for stardom. It's been a national park since 1981, and the vast bay is teeming with fascinating natural landmarks. A popular way of visiting Pangna Bay is by kayak, as they are the only way to get inside the grottos and sea caves.
Number 21. Waitomo Glowworm Caves. Under three hours from Auckland, the Waitomo Glowworm Caves are an intricate system of caves, subterranean rivers, and sinkholes. The highlight are the glowworms strewn across the ceiling, dangling and shining among the stalactites. These tiny creatures are found exclusively in New Zealand and are around the size of an average mosquito. From the water, your guide will take you through the tunnel, discussing both the science and legends behind the cave and its famous glowworms, a grotto that took 30 million years to form. Other highlights include zip lining through the illuminated cave. Number 20. Taprom Temple. Colloquially known as the Tomb Raider Temple, Taprom was built almost 900 years ago. Today, the ancient temple, which is slowly being eaten alive by the return of the rainforest, is a memorable mix of natural and man made beauty. Many of the temples around Angkor have been cleared, but Taprom remains a bastion to the rightful order of things. It's an experience that showcases the architectural genius of the Khmers, yet the eternal power of the jungle. Number 19. Svartifoss. Combining a waterfall with fascinating basalt columns, the Svartifoss is a sight not to be missed. The name translates to Black Falls due to the burnt lava that stands like an enormous organ behind the tumbling veil of white. To see the falls, you'll need to venture one mile from the car park with an elevation gain of over 350 feet. After 30 plus minutes, you'll be gawking at a 66-foot waterfall, with hexagonal columns forming one of the world's most unique waterfall backdrops. Number 18. Plitvicin National Park. One of the most beautiful natural wonders in Croatia and all of Europe, the Plitvicin National Park consists of several breathtaking lakes, waterfalls, and lush forest. The park's most notable features are the 16 interconnecting lakes that are divided into upper and lower clusters. Formed by natural travertine dams, the lakes range in distinct colors from turquoise to blue, green, and gray. Visitors can explore the lakes and surrounding area by walking along the assortment of wooden walkways as well as by boat. Number 17. El Peñón de Huatape. El Peñón de Huatape is a towering rock that soars out of the valley floor, weighing 10 million tons. Worshipped by the Tahamis for centuries, 
The rock became a major destination when the first known ascents were completed in 1954. Today, you can journey to the top of the giant monolith via a series of hair-raising staircases, admiring the postcard-worthy views along the way. The staircase follows the only crack in the otherwise perfect rock. After 649 steps, you'll look down on a veritable maze of lakes and distant islands. Number 16. Grand Prismatic Spring Famed and named for its kaleidoscopic colors, Grand Prismatic Spring lies in Yellowstone National Park, not far from other pretty pools and gushing geysers. Remarkably, it is the third largest hot spring in the world, reaching 110 meters in diameter and 50 meters in depth. While its size and scale are impressive, it is most noted for its captivating colors, with reds, oranges, yellows, greens, and blues all on show. These vivid hues make for a dazzling sight, particularly when contrasted with the desolate landscapes surrounding the steaming spring. Number 15. The Pinnacles In Nambung National Park in Western Australia, the Pinnacles are a rare geological formation in a country full of them. Two hours north of Perth, the Pinnacles are formed from limestone deposits left behind after the ocean receded over 25,000 years ago. Erosion played its part, carving each pinnacle into another masterpiece. These pillars of dense deposits and ancient seashells stand as high as 12 feet tall. From the impressive pillars, you can see the landscape change from vast desert to sparkling sand dunes and, eventually, the blue of the endless Indian Ocean. Number 14. Chocolate Hills The Chocolate Hills in the Philippines are a collection of over a thousand mounds that turn chocolatey brown during Bohol's dry season. Scattered like giant termite mounds through otherwise lush forests, the seemingly identical look of each would lead many to think they're man-made. Instead, the mounds were formed by the erosion of limestone over thousands of years. Only the hills remain to tell the tale. From various viewpoints, you can admire the chocolate hills that spread near and far. Number 13. Underwater Waterfall From up above, there are few more surreal sights than Mauritius's underwater waterfall. In the middle of the Indian Ocean, the waterfall tumbles down a deep crevasse into the deep, endless blue just off the edge of the lush island. If you're still trying to wrap your head around it, don't worry. It's merely an optical illusion. The 2.5-mile drop would make it the tallest waterfall on Earth. However, the look of the waterfall is formed by the combination of sand and silt that run along the island's ocean shelf. Number 12. Dead Vlay. 
Featuring one of the largest sand dunes on Earth and a petrified forest, Dead Vlei is a strange yet awe-inspiring destination. Over the ages, the dunes have rusted thanks to clay in the subsoil. As a result, the petrified trees, some as old as a thousand years, stand frozen in time as others decay under the endless sun. When you aren't admiring the skeletal trees, you can gaze upon the red dunes that soar over 1,300 feet towards the heavens. Number 11. Kelimutu Lakes Located on Flores Island, the Kelimutu Lakes are a trio of alpine lakes surrounded by dense greenery and rocks burnt by ancient lava flow. However, these lakes are far from your regular bodies of water. Frequent changes in the water's chemical elements means the water changes color as much as six times per year. Accessing Mount Kelimutu isn't difficult, with a sunrise hike adding even more memories to an unforgettable destination. Hiking trails lead to a natural balcony with breathtaking views of both the lake and into the distance. Number 10. Danical Depression Found in the northern section of the Afar Triangle, the Danical Depression is the hottest place on Earth. Beneath the surface, continental drift has created one of the most unique and alien-esque landscapes you'll experience on your travels. At its hottest, the Danical Depression can reach over 130 degrees Fahrenheit. It's one of the world's most desolate and dangerous regions where acidic springs, lava lakes, and volcanoes dot the landscape. Yet there are still signs of humanity, from the ghost town of Dalal to the nomadic Afar, who have survived in this surreal location for centuries. Number 9. Whitehaven Beach Found along the famous Great Barrier Reef, Whitehaven Beach is rated as one of the most spectacular places on Earth. For good reason, too. Eco-friendly and always pristine, the blinding white sands lead to calm seas with a vibrant world beneath the surface. Such a paradise tends to be remote, yet Whitehaven is only 30 minutes from the accessible Whitsunday Island. The crystal clear water is as blue as the sky above, making for excellent diving with the impossibly white sand greeting you with open arms as you make your way back to the surface. Number 8. Lensois Marines. Words can't do justice to the dune and lagoon combination found within Lensois Marines. At the same time, it is both starkly contrasting, yet the partnership is effortless. Only when standing on the golden dunes and admiring the turquoise waters will you understand. The massive dunes are spread across an eye-catching rolling expanse. Each peak rolls down into a trough of bright blue water, one of the national park's 1,000-plus lagoons. The otherworldly site is surprisingly off the beaten path and one enjoyed without a horde of fellow adventurers.
Number seven, Antelope Canyon. Impeccably carved by thousands of years of rain and wind, Antelope Canyon is a narrow passageway harboring some of the most spectacular landscapes on Earth. At its most narrow, the Slot Canyon is a mere three feet wide, having already dropped as much as 100 feet. The moment you step into either the upper or lower canyon, you'll feel a world away from the arid Arizona landscape, with the canyon artfully guiding you along. The beams that reach the canyon's floor add an extra layer of beauty to an already stunning destination. Number six, Cenotes of the Yucatan. Scattered along the Yucatan Peninsula in Mexico is a collection of beautiful cenotes that provide some of the most memorable swimming and diving experiences. Cenotes are often found in regions rich in limestone, creating underground swimming holes filled with fresh water, marine life, and flora. Each cenote has its own personality, whether it be an open-air cave or fully underground with giant stalactites dangling from the ceiling. Many are considered spiritual places whose underwater tunnels are teeming with historic artifacts and the legends of ancient gods, such as the sacred cenote near Chichen Itza. Number five, Salar de Uni. Located in the Andes Mountains, Salar de Uni is the largest salt flat in the world. The expanse of salt creates an unending white landscape during the dry season, but the area is most breathtaking in the rainy season when it's covered in water. The reflection of a blue sky creates a spectacular and surreal landscape, though some tourists insist on seeing the salt. One of the most unusual places to visit in South America, it's also a major breeding ground for flamingos. Number four, Meteora. Meaning elevated in Greek, Meteora is a jutting rock formation in northern Greece, a wild landscape made up of hill-like boulders that dominate the skyline. Part of what makes that magnificent landscape so amazing, however, are the monasteries that precariously cling to the rocks. Set on cliffs with staircases cut into the very stone itself, this religious site dates back to the 15th century, and some still welcome visitors to this day. The most famous of all, the Holy Trinity Monastery, perches an amazing 400 meters atop a natural rock tower and is a breathtaking sight to set eyes on. Number three, Hongohani Rice Terraces. 